We've talked before here on the Cow-Calf Corner about the management practice of changing when we feed the cows in order to influence when those cows calve. In other words, the old data that we've looked at coming from Iowa, some from uh, actually Canada, has uh, indicated that if we feed the cows later in the day, that we'd have a higher percentage of the cows calve during the daytime hours. That data has always been 30 and 40 years old. But now there's more recent uh, research information coming from Idaho and from Kansas, looking at that very management practice in more detail. What they did with the Idaho cows was to feed all of them in the morning hours. And they've got several years of data combined. As you look at this particular chart, you can see the calving pattern that they established was one where it just didn't seem to have much effect. About as many calves coming in the nighttime hours as calves coming in daylight. Now, when we take a look at what happened in Kansas, when they fed their forage sorghum hay at about dusk, then the influence of when those cows calved is rather dramatic. And you can see that a very high percentage of those cows were calving between 6 a.m. and 6 p.m. In fact, in this study, it was about 85%. Now, certainly that means that we're not uh, totally excused from getting up and, and checking first calf heifers in the middle of the night, in the middle of the winter, because we'll still have a few that just won't fit that pattern. But certainly, if we have a higher percentage of cows calving in daylight hours, we've got a better chance to be there and provide assistance if necessary. The calf is born when there's going to be some sunlight to provide some warming and uh, less chance of hypothermia, having a, an adverse effect on both the cow and the calf. So this year, as you're going into the spring calving season, consider if you can changing the feeding pattern to where the cows are fed very, very late in the day. I think you'll have a higher percentage of calves coming when you have a chance to be there and provide help if it's necessary. There is a, a link on the uh, SUNUP website to the research studies that uh, I'm referencing. Just go to sunup.okstate.edu, look under show links, and, and take a look at that for yourself and see if it doesn't convince you to uh, this year try to change that feeding pattern to where it's happening later in the day. Hey, we look forward to visiting with you again next week on SUNUP's Cow-Calf Corner. <music>